Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly couples reading for August 2019. Before I start, I'd like to thank all the people who have subscribed to my channel, liked, shared and commented. Um, those of you who have donated to my channel, thank you very much. Um, all the donations that you have made um, to my channel makes me feel supported. For those of you who are thinking of donating to my channel, yes, um, whether you want to donate anything from one dollar to however much you want to, this is totally from your heart. Um, it's totally up to you. Um, and thank you very much. For those of you who are interested in booking a private reading with me, yes, um, please check my about page and what um anything you need there you know you you find all my information my email paypal facebook website you know instagram everything is there <laughs> and once i hear from you i will get back to you and then we can get your reading done as soon as possible so yes cancer let's go ahead with the reading we are using your we are using the sexual magic deck Gilded Tarot, and then our clarification deck for your reading. And we will start now. Okay. So, Tarot and Universe, tell us what is going to be on the mind. Main concern for Cancer couples, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. What is going to be your main concern in August? for the couples yes okay okay as you can see this is the one that's flipped over ace of wands okay ace of wands right ace of wands okay okay so now we see this is more of a commitment okay being satisfied in love is something that you are going to be focusing on this month okay so let's see what um let's see what the gilded tarot says what's coming in the first week for cancer couples in the first week of oh okay okay we got five of cups i'll take it yeah second week okay four of cups <laughs> now that's interesting third week what's coming i'll take both five of pentacles and king of pentacles now that is interesting for the third week okay okay i think i'll put it this way and what is coming in the final week in august in the last week of august was coming for the cancer couples okay okay what is the to know oh six of pentacles okay the bottom deck is nine of wands okay 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 cancer sun moon rising and venus signs okay 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 so right yes 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 mm. as we can see it's all going to be good by the end of the month okay so at the beginning of the month this is how you'll be feeling I feel there's a disappointing decision you want to make 
because look here can you see both of these guys are on their knees okay and I feel is this is more heartbreaking news okay yes heartbreaking news a decision you know you need to make or some news that you would hear um, concerning you and your partner that's going to make you a bit upset you know but I feel this is another cup offered to you in the second week of the month cancer this is this is your own card okay this is your own card and I feel like there is going to be a little bit of an issue here because this is going to be your main concern you know starting afresh or you know something to do with your relationship that something need to be renewed okay I feel I want to make a clarification okay Tarot and Universe please clarify the five of pentacles for cancer couples okay wow cancer you've got a lot of you've got a lot of pentacles what's all this Pentacle, 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 pentacles. Oh, yes, pentacles. Okay. So. Okay, okay, okay. Right. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, so now I'm noticing something, yeah? You've got two fives here. I feel this is more to do with news that is not making you happy. But I don't feel you are going to split up. I don't feel I don't feel like that. I don't feel that any of you is going to be single cuz here there's togetherness here. That's how I feel with this particular deck. When I see the five of pentacles, you are, I feel these people are inside. They're not outside. There is a baby involved. Okay. There's a baby involved here. So whatever it is, I feel no matter how sad the news is for you, Cancer, I feel you, you get emotional support from your loved ones your relatives, people you know, in, in communities that will support you. You know, I feel like you are not left on your own. Okay, don't feel like you're on your own, however you feel it is. Finances could be of an issue, okay? But, yes, 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 yes okay 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 so let's see what the pin king of pentacles is here tarot and universe clarified the king of pentacles for cancer couples what cancer you're not alone you're not alone at all you're not alone at all don't be upset don't be sad don't be, don't be, don't be, don't not be. Look, look at all these pentacles. Yes, you are the couples. And if even you're going through financial hardship, or if your partner is telling you things not going well or right, which is affecting your relationship, an offer will be coming in in the second week. Yeah. 
that is going to give you more hope. Yes. Um, my throat was too dry. <laughs> yes. I feel like any, any disappointing news here is you're going to get um, an offer. Okay? But I feel this offer will be bringing you stability in your love life and your relationship. Because in the third week, here you are, going to people that you can trust, going to people who will certainly help you. <clears throat> That's how I feel, you know? And here you are, you've got this nine of pentacles lady here, who is a Virgo. She's going to help you. Or it could be that, you know, um, you'll be going to be connected to someone who's a Virgo or someone who's an earth sign. Yes, someone who is an earth sign in the third week because there's a lot of earth here. Pentacles, you know, Cancer? All these pentacles here. Yeah? And this king of pentacles could be Taurus or, or, or Aries, but I feel it's more of um, an earth sign, you know, Tor Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn, whichever. But I feel in the third week, this is, this is, this is it. You're going to come into contact with someone who is an earth sign. So whatever it is, or you are in a relationship with someone who is an earth sign, and things are going to get better. If you have had an argument, okay, and feeling like you can't be asked, if you're feeling like you've broken up the relationship, in the first week, you know, um, or you think I want to forget about them. Second week, this person could be knocking at your door. Not, not literally, but they could be making, um, how do I say it, contact with you. Okay? So it's not a relationship that is broken up, but it's, it's neither here or there. That is how... I'm feeling with this. You are certainly not on your own, Cancer. You are certainly not on your own. Because this, we've got, we've got two people here. We've got two people here. You know? So, I feel like at the end of the month, you know, you'll be finding balance. If things have not gone right for you, for the two of you, you know, um, there will be some balance. I feel communication will start again. This person could be bringing something in the relationship that um, can create um, some form of bond between you two. Okay? So I feel like, yes, it's, it's a new... How do I say it? This person is certainly coming in and, and making an offer. This person is going to make an offer for uh, a brand new beginning. For the relationship to start again. That's how I feel. I know it sounds like I'm all over the place. Um, but I also feel like most mostly um, this is a relationship that is not a relationship. If you know what I mean. It's neither here or there. It's like you're together, but you're not together. Because sometimes you've... It's like in your head, you're a couple, but physically you are not a couple kind of thing, you know? So I feel this is what is going to be, whether the person is physically coming to you or you are going to find some form of understanding between the two of you. Something is going to happen for you to reconsider this relationship or if even it's a relationship, yes, because this is a reading for couples. Well, I hope this has been insightful for you, Cancer. 
and um, I will leave the reading here before um, it continues to, you know, get more complicated. <laughs> so, yes, thank you for staying with me and I wish you all the best. You can please check the general reading and um, or you can also swap over to my other channel and watch the pick a card readings. So thank you very much, Cancer. I will see you next month or you will see me next month.